talking to California Car Company. Sunny day, Roswell, Georgia. And for sale, 1952 Plymouth. Tell me more about this car, Jim. This uh, belonged to a friend of mine. Uh, I've, I've known him for years and he passed away in December. So I have this car here and I'm selling it for his widow. It's a really nice 52 Plymouth Cranbrook four-door sedan. And it's got 58,000 actual miles. And he's driven it all over the state, up into Tennessee and the Carolinas. Um, it's an original car. He had it repainted, had the bumpers replated. Uh, he changed the rear end so that it would run high speeds. It's got a high speed rear end in it, but other than that, it's an original car. And it really is a very solid, rust free car from Chattanooga, Tennessee, originally. Mm -hmm. So take a walk around and I'll be happy to show you some of the details. Does it have a trunk? 1952 Plymouth. Did you say Cranbrook? I love the visor. Yeah, that's kind of a neat option for those city walls. It almost looks like 1952 carbon fiber. There you go. All right. That's the original trunk mat, the original trunk and tools. Mm -hmm. It's never had any rust anywhere. It's solid as a rock. If you take a look at the interior, the back seat's really comfortable. The original door panels are like new on it. Nice headliner. Oh it's my. Got dealer installed seat covers. The dashboard and all the trim is just beautiful on it. Listen to this door. It's just as solid as can be. That's beautiful. And you would think an older car like this would be perhaps a challenge to start, but this one runs. It's got uh, split exhaust from the muffler back. See the speedometer, 58,000 miles. Original radio works. It has a Plymouth suicide knob or Brody knob, factory knob on it, so you can steer it easily. Original headliner. The visor shields the sun, keeps the driver from being blinded by the sun. But you can really tell with the exhaust system in the back. It really sounds like a V8. Rev it out. Let's take a look. Take a look. That sounds great. It has new brakes, new clutch. That's the original VIN plate. Again, the doors are just solid as can be. Now it says street rod on the side, and right. did you say Cranbrook? Cranbrook is what the model number is. Mike, okay. Mike found that uh, emblem at a swap. He put that mm -hmm. on there. That's the original Flathead 6. You might want to zoom in and see the nice VIN plate ID tags on the uh, firewall. It had a uh, the original radiator developed a, a core problem, so he had a custom built aluminum radiator, four core radiator built for it. And that keeps it very cool. It never goes over about 25% on the temperature gauge. Very cool. And it'll run 75 miles an hour now and get 24 miles to the gallon. It's a very economical engine. The biggest shortcoming was it, it wouldn't go over about 55 unless uh, you had a high-speed rear, which it has now. Now this is a really good, a really good little car. And all the money, of course, will go to the widow. So mm -hmm. we hope you'll have some interest in it. And book and retail, what kind of uh, numbers are you looking it's at? It's a great buy at 13.5, and the book price is about 20,000. So. Uh, again, we're just trying to help the widow out. Yes, and what's the best way to reach you, Jim? 770-992-8801. And that's Monday through Friday uh, from 8 to 8. And on Saturdays, we're open from 9 to 6. Very good. And the website? is CaliforniaCarCo.com. CaliforniaCarCo.com. And the phone number? 770-992-8801. 8801. All right. Come Thank by you, and take Jim. a look at it. Beautiful day, Roswell, Georgia. California Car Company. CaliforniaCarCo.com.